Hello everybody, I am Wild Man Wes. And I am Hefe. And welcome to a special edition of Masterpiece Theatre What's Your Poison. Today Hefe and I are going to be reading a lovely tale. Yes, it is Good Night Brew. This is written by Anne E. Baratad. <laughs> That's not... <laughs> I was really... Braided? 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 Yeah. If anybody knows in the comment section below. <laughs> <laughs> uh, illustrated by Ali Og. So good night, Brew. And we've miss we have something missing. Ah. Uh, we have no beer. But ha! Ah, we can fix that. Aha! Uh -huh. Today we'll be doing a beer that we've had before. This is the Monty Python's Holy Grail Ale. The Holy Grail Ale. Oh, yes. <laughs> what a fitting way. Class. Glass in a glass. Can't glass stop. in a glass with some sass. <laughs> with some sass. So before we read this book, we're going to take a trip down memory lane with Monty Python's Holy Grail Ale. Cheers. Mm, refreshing. Little refreshing. Little bit of funk skunk in there. Just a little. Because it's very, very, it's very English. It is very English. Rather. 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 No. Oh, yeah. I, 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 I do. Quite. 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 Mm. But it does say it is made also with tempered burning witches. Ah, yes. Burning witches. Yes. Burn the witch! Oh, my. Oh, my. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we are going to be finishing up a little bit of this ale, and then we will get right into reading. Good night, Brew. Good night, Brew. By Anne E. Brayton. Illustrated by Ali Og. In the great brew room, there was a kettle that shone, and a gramophone, and a pitcher of a chocolate stout with two feathers of foam. And there were three little otters in charge of the water for fermenting some yeast, and a hops wildebeest, and a black bear named Charlie, and sweet malted barley, and bottles and clogs, and a whirling warthog. And a flavorful cash, and a whole ton of mash, and a baritone brewer with a foamy mustache. Oh, oh, oh. good night, brew. Good night, crew. Good night, Mooney Cockatoo. Good night, Cash. And good night, Mash. Good night, kettle and tanks of metal. Good night, barley. Good night, Charlie. Good night, wildebeest. And yeast. Good night, bottles and barefoot waddles. Good night, Saison. Good night, wheat. Good night, porter and clogged feet. Good night, stout and IPA. Good night, Bach and hog ballet. Good night, waltz and derrieres. Good, Good night, night, beer lovers, lovers everywhere. everywhere. And that is it, except. There is a few things on the next page. We're going to do a close-up. So this goes over the brewing basics, uh, starting with ingredients, what ingredients are used in beer, water, malted barley, brewer's yeast, and hops. Uh, then it gives you a step-by-step. -step. First step, the mashing, then laudering, brewing, fermenting, conditioning, packaging, and drinking! Drinking is always good, folks. Goes into a little detail about each step, which is pretty cool. Um, outside of the ingredients, they also have a flavors, uh, the flavors that you can look for in beers, the flavorful cash that they talked about in the story. They talk about all of the different things that they add to beers, which are pretty cool. They've got dandelion, hibiscus, rose petal, wheat, of course, uh, lemons and limes, chili peppers. Some things you wouldn't imagine, but oh, yeah, they do. So uh, there's a whole bunch of really fun things in there. And then at the end here, they have the beer types and styles. They have ales and lagers, and then they kind of break down just a few handfuls of uh, each of the styles between the ales and the lagers, which is really cool. The common ales and common lagers they have there um, with the Wheel de Beast. Um, <laughs> yeah, this was, a, this was a lot of fun yeah. to read. This is a good I, little I story. I thought so, too. I mean, I got it for Christmas this year, and Happy had let me know that he got it last year for Christmas. Yeah, I... So we thought for you this would be just a nice little, you know... A step aside from the normal reviews that we have done and have a little fun, get a little more creative with what we do. Absolutely. 
Well, we hope you enjoyed this episode. Make sure you leave a thumbs up. Leave a thumbs down if you didn't really like this story. If you really did like this story, make sure you watch it again and again and again before bedtime. Because, you know, sometimes a good bedtime story is what you need. Other than that, make sure that you share on social media, and as always, push that little red button, and don't forget to ring the bell for instant notifications on Dragonfire Entertainment. And if you're not too busy, once you're done with this video, make sure you check out Hefe's channel, Beer You, Beer Me. He's got a lot of great stuff coming up. I sure do. I've got a whole month full of videos that have actually very little to do with beer, but cousin beverages like ciders and meads and stuff like okay. that. Also, uh, I'm going to have a gluten-free beer episode as well to kind of explain further on how that works. Uh, I just like to try to get as wide a variety of the beverage of kings known as beer. Amen on that, and I'm looking forward to it. Until then, I'm Wildman Wes. And I'm Hefe. And we'll see you next time on What's Your Poison. Take care, be safe, good night, brew, and good night to you. <laughs>